Well, now has arrived the great moment of truth. Does the camera turn on? Did I wire it correctly? Is the glue going to hold? Well, all this and more at 5 o'clock on the blah 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 news. Here at blah 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 and blah blah blah, we believe in blah blah blah. Blah 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 blah. Alright, focus you. It was good. So I crudely uh, burned a hole through the bottom of this case that was already pretty broken and uh, wired in this connector for the battery replacement part I got. It's going to sit kind of like this. Ain't exactly sure how I'm going to sit the battery since there's going to be a piece sitting right here. So maybe I'll just like tape it over the TF card or I don't know if I wish. Hang it over the front, and like sitting on top of the Genie logo, like maybe some double Velcro or something. But if it works, and we will find that out real short here. All right, so I've had had the oldie charger charging up the what kind of battery is that? The battery, the 3.7 volt 500 milliamp battery. It was built to go inside, but since the last one nearly detonated inside because I couldn't tell it was overinflating, I figure maybe maybe I have it sitting outside the case, so if it's getting big and starting to explode, I can see the thing. All right, so here we go. I'm going to hope that I use the right connector. Plug it in, plug it in. All right, does it turn on? Would it turn on with battery power? Sweet mother of God. Well, hot, right? Looky there. Screen's still busted because the battery got too big. But the battery works. Yeah, for them. Yeah, I'm thinking, I'm just thinking of Velcro that bit, must just like that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that's going to work great. Does it unplug well? Huh? Huh? Oh, yeah.